A very good evening and Om Shanti to all of listeners. Welcome back to your own channel, Seek the Soul that Truth Lies Within. And today in this Godly Blessing, we're going to learn how to keep our register clear and clean by the power of silence or through meditation. So what is this register? The register is the register of karmas. So let's get on with it. Let's understand the title. Baba says, may you keep your register clean with the power of silence and be loved by God and the divine family. And the explanation goes like this. Just as science has created an invention whereby whatever you have written can be erased. Let's see on our laptops. Earlier we used to have erasers on the books. Now the time has come for the laptops. Everything is done on the laptop now. Or the e-way, your mobile phones, emails. So everything is done on the internet now. So we can easily press a delete button and we can erase whatsoever has been written. So Baba says can be erased. So you can't even tell something was written on it. In the same way, clean your register, register means register of karmas with the power of silence. So throughout our life, we go around in the survival mode. We think that it is important to earn, it is important to progress our family. But while doing so, do we keep a check on our karmas? Do we even think or look back as what have we done throughout the day? Have we given suffering and pain or happiness and have we earned blessings from people or have we earned curses from people? Hardly any of us keep a register of that. So God says, when you are in silence in the state of meditation, keep a check of your register. So, and you can clean it. So how do we clean it? In the same way, clean your register with the power of silence and you will be loved by God and the divine family. That means we should be concerned about what we are going to take at the end of the day when we are leaving this body. Have we accumulated in a bank like you have a passbook? right you have a bank account and you have your account you know what is going in and what is going out so god says when you're sitting in silence or in the state of meditation look at the whole picture run that picture throughout of the whole day in that silence mode and find out what have you accumulated what is the plus that is the green and what is the red what is the minus in your account or in your register and if you've done some sins then you make sure that you, when you're sitting in silence, you accumulate enough willpower with the knowledge which God has given, with the affirmations which God has given, and you remove or you erase the habit of repeating those mistakes again. And then God says, everyone loves honesty and cleanliness. And the biggest or the most important honesty and cleanliness is to be with ourselves and with God. If somebody is honest with God, that soul is honest with everybody on this earth and with themselves too. So if we are not honest with God or we, if we are not honest with ourselves and God, then we can never be honest with anybody in this world. This is why you must not let any wasteful thoughts or wasteful actions stray from one day to the next. So, wasteful thoughts and wasteful actions should not go on to the next day. We generally believe in spirituality that when you wake up in the morning, next day in the morning, that's your new birth, your new life, and you can create new thoughts. You can ask for forgiveness the previous night from God for all those negative or impure things which you have done. And when you wake up the next day, you have a new birth and you have new thoughts not the wasteful thoughts of the past, no regrets of the past, and then you start doing something good and you erase what you've done negative. So God says, let the past be the past and put a full stop and your register will remain clean. Full stop means full stop to those wasteful thoughts, wasteful actions and wasteful words also. So put a full stop and your register will remain clean and the Lord will be pleased. So. How do we please Supreme Godfather, Supreme Creator or Supreme uh, B? 
being who is keeping a complete list of all those actions which we are doing on a daily basis it's getting automatically uploaded there just like it gets uploaded in the server so everything is getting uploaded in the spiritual server over here so god will see that this register is coming clean it's a better register so it, for him the karma is the register of just like for a businessman the register of accounts is the register so for god anybody who sends a good register that means good accounts of karma is somebody who is appreciated by the main business man sitting up there so how do we do that what are the different methods of removing wasteful thoughts what exactly are the different karmas we think about negative positive karma but they can be impure pure karma waste karma they can be useful karma and then there is neutral karma we can all learn about it at brahma kumari's godly spiritual university for free have a blessed good night and om shanti